Hey everyone, how are you doing today? So in today's video is my Cartier shopping vlog. And also please make sure to check the description box for the um, sizing guide for the Justin Clue, the new and old Ecru, Panthère de Cartier, Love Bracelet, and Love Cuff. So make sure to check the timestamps in the description box. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. I upload videos every week about luxury, fashion, beauty, diptyque, unboxing. If these are your type of videos, please consider subscribing to my channel. And also don't forget to hit the bell so you will not miss any of my future videos. So I was planning to size up my love bracelet and uh, I will share with you a little story on that on my next video which is the unboxing video right now i will share with you my shopping blog so my essay was on vacation at that time when i visited cartier but she was able to manage to arrange an appointment with her manager to assist me just for the try on because i wanted to try on first regards to the sizing the right size for me because my old uh, love bracelet was too tight on me it was really really tight so it's time to size up to update my bracelet collection to upgrade to update and size up my love bracelet i tried on the love bracelet love cuff the plain one and i was going to try on the love cuff in one diamond however it is not available at the time they don't have the stock the sa would have to order one from another store so i tried on those bracelets so the love cuff is tight on me because it was uh, size 18 as you can see it has the protective stickers so it looks dull here is a sizing guide for you guys so I was able to get the proper sizing this was according to my essay so you need to know the right size for your love bracelet first or you would know your size for the just and clue and also for the love cup so in my case i am a size 18 for the love bracelet so my just and clue should be in the size 17 which that is what i got from last time and since my love bracelet is 17 it doesn't match with my current just and clue that's why i am trying to update to size up my love bracelet that's the reason why i am trying on all of these bracelet first so on my next visit when my essay came back from vacation she's able to transfer this love cuff with one diamond from another store my essay came back from vacation she's able to transfer this love cuff with one diamond it's brand new it has the protective stickers this is in the size 19 it's a little bit loose but uh, I was told that this is the last piece that they have right now and someone wanted to buy this as well so because if I'm not gonna get this they will give it to somebody else um, someone's waiting uh, to buy this I was deciding the fit is not really sure about the fit but since they told me 19 is the right size for me so we shall see And now moving on to the other bracelets, I also tried on the new Ecru and the old Ecru.
tried on the Ecru, the old Ecru, and the new Ecru. The new Ecru, it was just launched three or four months ago, and uh, I asked my SA which is which one does she like more. She liked the old Ecru bracelet than the new one, which is I agree to her. The old Ecru is nice for stacking, but the new Ecru, if you're gonna wear it by itself, it's more it's perfect if you're just going to uh, wear it by itself but if it's not then the old accru is good for stacking by the way most of these are, are in the yellow gold and also that's the reason why i wanted to update my bracelet collection because i wanted to switch from my white gold to yellow gold so in terms of sizing so it runs big similar to just and clue so if like me, I am a size 18 for the love bracelet, so I should go for the size 17 for the new Ecru and the old Ecru bracelet. I am a size 19 for the love cuff. So here it is, I am trying on the Panther de Cartier or Panthea de Cartier. I was inspired to check on this because of my sister Jen, a Miss Photogenic in Style by Jen channel. I was so excited to see this and try this on. The Panther de Cartier is very stunning. It has the onyx on the nose and it has two Savoret garnets on the eyes. It's very, very beautiful. Although the bracelet is hollow, so it's really, really lightweight, uh, similar to the Justin Clue. And I love love everything from Cartier. By the way, most of these that I tried are in the yellow gold. And also that's the reason why I wanted to update my bracelet collection because I wanted to switch from my white gold to yellow gold. In terms of the sizing, so this runs big similar to Justin Clue and also the new and old Ecru. So I'm supposed to get a size 17. The one I'm trying on is a size 18, so it, it's a little bit big for me. Don't have stock for those, so I need to place an order for that. The Panther de Cartier is very stunning. It has the onyx on the nose. It has two Savoret garnets on the eyes. Very, very beautiful. So before I head out, I was able to check on the new handbags that they have. It's the Double C de Cartier. I just browsed on those handbags. I didn't have time to really check on those or try them on um, but she showed me one handbag and i'll probably check on that next time so i finally decided to get one of the bracelets and you will find out on my next video which is the unboxing so stay tuned for that so stay tuned for my next video and i hope you enjoy this video if you have any questions regarding sizing anything about Cartier bracelets let me know in the comment section and that is all for today's video and if you have any questions leave it in the comment section and that is all for today's video i hope you enjoyed this video i'll see you next time make sure to like comment subscribe to my channel hit that notification bell i'll see you next time thank you guys for watching Bye!